Greetings friends. We are anonymous. On Thursday, September 1st, on Wall Street, a small group of demonstrators were met with police intimidation while performing a peaceful and legal occupation of a public sidewalk. Nine were arrested for disorderly conduct and later released without charge. One demonstrator was held for 24 hours because he was unable to provide proof of residency. This demonstration was intended to serve as a one-night test run for the September 17th occupation using the legal encampment strategy. According to a federal court ruling in 2000, the use of public sleeping as a means of symbolic expression is allowed on public sidewalks in New York City. Despite fully obeying the law, demonstrators were still met with police violence and intimidation. This event serves to remind us that we're living in a police state with absolutely no respect for the right of the people to peacefully assemble and exercise their constitutional free speech. But we will not be scared away or deterred. This abuse of authority by the NYPD only serves to strengthen our resolve and reinforce our belief that corruption and injustice in America must be fought. Our mission is as follows. On the 17th of September, we want to see 20,000 people flood into Lower Manhattan, set up tents, kitchens, peaceful barricades and occupied Wall Street for a few months. Once there, we shall incessantly repeat one simple demand in a plurality of voices and we will not leave until that demand has been met. Like our brothers and sisters in Egypt, Greece, Spain, and Iceland. We plan to use the revolutionary Arab Spring tactic of mass occupation to restore democracy in America. We also encourage the use of non-violence to achieve our ends and maximize the safety of all participants. We are anonymous. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Wall Street, expect us.